Good evening, ladies and gentlemen. How are you? Good evening, teacher. Good evening, my friend. How are you doing? Uh, not bad. <laughs> not bad at all. Okay. Excellent. <laughs> well, welcome on board. Let's begin. Buenas noches. Este es el Programa Nacional de Inglés para el Trabajo, modalidad online. Beginner one. Welcome to your English class. Today is Wednesday, August 17th. This is class 12. Simple present WH questions. Part two. Okay, this is, this is the general objective. This is the specific objective. And this is the class objective. At the end of the class period, participants will be able to ask information questions and give our answers. Agenda, review, form, WH questions, uh, WH questions, practice, make questions. Okay. Attendance. Today is Wednesday, August 17th, okay? Diana Veronica Perez. Excellent. Excellent, nice. Eric Josué Reyes. Eric. Francisco Anderson Barrientos. Gabriela Alejandra Calderón. Gabi. Present teacher. Excellent, Gaby. Present. Come on board. Glenda Carolina Barón. Present teacher. Excellent. Welcome on board, Glenda. Henry Emerson Hernandez. No. Irma Mercedes Flores. Okay. Jasmine de Los Angeles Bonilla. Excellent. Nice. Karen Guzman. Jelsin. Johnny Alexander Escobar. Present teacher. Excellent. Nice. Jorge Alberto Castillo. Present teacher. Excellent. Nice. Jose Alfredo Hueso. María Dolores Enríquez. María Dolores. Marjorie Angélica Cardón. Marjorie. Marlene Marisol Nájera. Moisés Ernesto Meléndez. Odalis Nicole Menéndez Paniagua. Ramiro Rafael Aguilar Díaz. Rosemary Jennifer Pérez. And Wilfredo José Flores. Okay. Present teacher. 
Ah, Wilfredo, excellent. Okay, let's begin. Um, let's review. Look at this girl. What does she have in her hand? What does she have in her hand? Flower. She flowers. has flowers. She has flowers. What, uh, what does she have on her head? Hat. A hat. She has a hat. Okay, excellent. Where does she go to collect flowers? Where does she go to collect flowers? To the forest. Maybe to the forest. Oh, of course. Mm -hmm. Snow White, Blancanieves, okay, so. <laughs> hmm. Okay, warm up. We make questions like this. We say, you live in town. Do you live in town? Yes, I do. Or no, I don't. Where do you live in town? I live near the plaza. She watches TV. Does she watch TV? Yes, she does. No, she doesn't. What time does she watch TV? She watches TV at night. What does she watch on TV? She watches um, soap operas, plomo and la sangre. No. Okay. Plomo and la sangre, imagine. Soap operas. Match the verbs and the nouns. Where do you study English? Where does Maria work? Why do they go home so early? When do they open their store? When does he start work? How do you say trabajo in English? How do you, I mean, sorry, different color. What do you do on weekends? What does luck mean in English? What does Mark buy for lunch? Who do you go out with? Volunteer to read. Good evening, Ramiro. Okay. Good evening, teacher. Yes. Okay. Ramiro first and then Johnny. Okay. Okay. Where do you study English? Where does Maria work? Why do they go home so early? When do they open their store? When does he start work? How do you stay trabajo? What do you say trabajo in English? How do you say trabajo? Uh -huh. What do you do on weekends? What do, does luck mean in English? What does Mark buy the, for lunch? Yeah. Who do you go out with? Okay, excellent. Thank you very much. Now, Johnny. Okay. Where do you study English? Where does Maria work? Why do they go home so early? When do they open their store? When does he start work? How do you do say trabajo in English? What do you do on weekend? What does look mean in, in English? What does Mark buy for lunch? Who do you do? Who do you go? Who do you go out with? Excellent. Very good, Johnny. Thank you. Thank you, teacher. Another volunteer. Yes, Gabby, go ahead. 
Uh, where do you study English? Where does Maria work? Why do you they go home so early? When do you they open their store? When does he start work? How do you say trabajo in English? What do you do on weekend? What does luck mean in mean in English? English. What does luck mean in English? What does Mark buy your buy for lunch? Who do you go out with? With. Excellent. Very good. Thank you. Nice. Very good. Okay. Okie dokie. Another volunteer. Thank you, Wilfredo. Go ahead. Uh, where do you study English? Where does Maria work? Why, uh, why do they go home so, her so early? Uh, when do they open their store? When does he start work? How do you say trabajo in English? What do you do on weekends? What does look, look at me in English? What does Mark buy for lunch? Who do you go out with? Excellent. Very good. Thank you, Wilfredo. That's very nice. Okay. Another volunteer. Thank you, Jose Alfredo. Hey, Jose Alfredo. Llegué. Yes. Llegué. Excellent. Very good, my friend. Begin. You may begin. Okay. Where do you study English? Where does Maria work? Why do they go home so early? Why do continue Jose. they open their store? When does, when does he start work? How do you say trabajo in English? How do you do on weekends? What what do you do on weekends? Ah, perdón. What do you do? What does look mean in English? What, what does Mark? Perdón. Continue, my friend. Yes, it's okay. Continue. What does luck mean in English? What does Mark for luck? What does luck mean in English? Okay. What does Mark buy for lunch. Who do you go? Go not wait. Wait, pardon. Excellent. Very good. Thank you very much. Nice. Thank you, teacher. Welcome. Okay, let's continue. Pre-task form. WH question. To describe someone's activities. Okay. Again, who, what, when, where, which, how, why, whose, who, what, when, where, which, how, why, whose. Okay, who is quien, what, que. When, cuando, where, donde, which, cual, how, como, why, por qué, whose, the king. And the, com the combined, the ones that are in combination, go. Si. Okay. Let me see. Before we get to this, okay, 
say over here. In combination. How often? How often? Let's change the color. Okay, how often Oops. how often how long how many how much How far, how well, okay. These are some combinations. How often, con que frecuencia? How long, por cuanto tiempo? How, how many, no how many, emotion. How many? Quantos? How much? Quanto o y precio? How much? How far? A qué distancia? Cuán lejos? How well? How well? Que también? Okay, so let's see. How often do you go to the movies? How often do you go to the movies? How long? How long does the movie last? Teacher, las, durar. Durar es las. ¿Cuánto dura la película? How long does the movie last? How many brothers and sisters do you have? How many brothers and sisters do you have? How much? How much does the book cost? How far do you live from here? How far do you live from here? How well? How well do you play soccer? How well do you play soccer? ¿Qué también juegas al fútbol? How well do you play soccer? How well do you play soccer? How far do you live from here? How much does the book cost? How many brothers and sisters do you have? How long does the movie last? How often do you go to the movies? Other ideas. What color what size what color what size what kind
What time? What color? ¿Qué color? What size? ¿Qué tamaño? What kind? ¿Qué clase? What time? ¿A qué horas? Ok. What color? What color do you prefer? What size do you wear? What kind of movies? What kind of movies do you watch? What kind of movies do you watch? What time? What time do you go to bed? What time do you go to bed? So, what color, what size, what kind, what time? How often, how long, how many, how much, how far, how well? Which book do you prefer? The red or the blue? Which book do you prefer? The red or the blue? ¿Cuál libro prefieres? El rojo o el azul? Which book do you prefer? Prefer, prefer. The red or the blue? Okay, so combinations, combined, right? Questions? No questions, okay. Okie dokie. Continue then, my dear ones. Okay. First thing to do in the in the group. Five questions. Choose the correct option to complete. These are the answers. Okay. Answer. Answers. Okay. Please answer these questions in the group. Let, let's see. How many people are we? Nine, right? Nine people. No, 15 we are. 15. Mm. Four groups, four groups. Permissions, permissions, okay. Four groups. Okay. The groups are open, so you may join. Okay. Teacher, now you can see the groups, right? OK. 
Henry is in group two. Jasmine is in group two. Moises is in group two. Okay. Jasmine is in group two. Moises. Hi, teacher. Good night. Hello, good evening. Good evening. Excuse me. Es que no podía compartir la pantalla y entonces por eso le pedí ayuda. Pero ya, ya lo, ya lo logramos. Okay. Okay. Eh, ¿Quién comienza, Eric? De Rosemary, Diana. Okay. La primera, eh, la primera, where? 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 You... Sí, correcto. Where do you go? Neighbor. ¿Cómo se dice neighbor? Neighbor hood. Hood, hood. Neighborhood. Neighborhood. Ok. Perdón, Eric, estaba leyendo en voz alta. Neighborhood. Ok. What time do you get up in the morning? In the uh -huh. five? In the morning, I get up at the other. Yeah, we okay. go to work. Um, Entonces sería, sería how, how, how do you, go, how to do you go to work? Ajá. Uh -huh. uh -huh. Go to work by bus. Ajá. Uh -huh. Entonces ya las tenemos number las one. cinco. Que... Sí. El number, eh, number one. What is? Where. 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 Uh -huh. Literal B. Where. Where. Sí. Literal B. Literal B. No, no, la primera, literal. Número uno, literal. B. Neighbor. Teacher. Neighborhood. Neighborhood. Yeah. Neighborhood. Okay. Neighborhood. Neighborhood. Entonces sería el literal B. Is called neighborhood. B. Número dos. Yeah. Sería at about five yen. 
¿A qué horas tú te despiertas en la mañana? Dice. At about 5 a.m. Ok. Rosemary, si gusta la siguiente. Es la vez, si no me equivoco. Sí, la B, correcto. Uh, how do you go to work? I go to work by bus. Uh, es la B. Entonces, resumiendo, sería la 1 es... Uh, where. where do you go shopping in your neighborhood? In the market near my home. Uh, la número 12 sería... Who, uh, la who, C. Do who do you play basketball with? Uh, with my friends. ¿Con quién quieres tú jugar basketball? Con mis amigos. La tres es... How when, often? When, how when? often. Uh -huh. Es que aquí aplicaría la dos, ¿verdad, teacher? En la número tres. When do you study the lesson? Every day. ¿Cuándo tú estudias la lección? Pero también podría ser, how often do you study the lesson? Sí, primeramente, how often, porque every day es frecuencia. Ah, ok. Es frecuente es todos los días. Entonces sería, how often. ¿verdad? ¿Qué tanto estudias okay. una lección? Ok. La número cuatro. Era la B, ¿verdad? What time, what time do you get up in the morning? At about 5 a.m. Y la última dijo Rosemary, que es la B, que how do you go to work? I go to work by bus. Ok. Yeah. Ah, hasta ahí llega, ¿verdad? Excelente. Yes. Okay, now let's continue. What's the correct answer for number one? Where? Where? Where, Where do you go shopping in your neighborhood? Where do you go the shopping? Market. The neighborhood. Neighborhood. In the market near my home. In my home. In the market near my home. <laughs> Excellent. Number two. Who? Who do you play basketball with? With. Who do you play basketball with? With my friends. With my friends. Three. How often? How often do you study the lesson? Every day. Four. What time? What time? What time do you get up in the morning? Five. How? How do you go to work? Excellent. Task preparations. WH questions to ask about varied information. Okay. What do you see in the picture? What do you see in the picture? Butterfly on flower? A butterfly on a flower. What, flower. Color, the flower. what color is the flower? Purple. purple. Uh -huh. Blue and purple, right? Blue and purple, yes. Yes. What color is the butterfly? White, brown, white. 
white, brown, purple, and blue. And blue. Light blue. Light blue. Yeah. White. Excellent. Nice. Okay. Now you have to make questions about this, the answers. Okay. And this is the other one. Okay. These are the ones that you're going to be doing. Okay. So I'm going to give you an idea about this one. John goes out every Friday. The question is, this is the answer. Every Friday. So the question is, how, how often, often? How often does John go out? How often does John go out every Friday? With her brother, with her brother. Brother is a person. Who? Who does Mary practice English? Who does Mary practice English with? Okay. Who does Mary practice English with? With her brother. Okay. Betty starts work at 8 a.m. What time? What time does Betty start work? Exactly. So you continue with the others. And then you do this one and this one. So one that is page 14, page 15, page 16. Okay, groups are opening. Please join. Diana is in one, Moises is in two, Irma is in three. Moises is in group two, and Diana is in group two. Moises, group two, Diana, group one. Aquí sería eh, Saúl. Saúl is a lawyer. Who is Who does Saul? Who does it Saul? No. No. How do you ask about a job? ¿Cómo pregunta acerca de un de lo que hace alguien? What What do you do, Saul? No. No. Tengo que ir a repasar. <laughs> Sería. What does Saul do? What does. What does Saul do? What does Saul do? What does Saul do? Okay. What does Saul do? Saul is a lawyer. Saul is a lawyer. Mm -hmm. Excellent. What. John. Go out. Y la respuesta es eh, every Friday. 
La otra, la segunda es siempre igual. Todas son las respuestas. Nosotros debemos de hacer las preguntas. Mary practice English with her brother. Aquí la clave es with porque se utiliza con who, ¿verdad? ¿Con quién? Entonces sería como who, who, who does Mary uh -huh. who does Mary practice English with? Y sería with her brother, con su hermano. En la número tres, Betty Star works at AEM. Sería Betty como... Uh, exacto, ¿a qué horas inicia a qué horas inicia Betty a trabajar? Formular la, la pregunta. What time? Ay, que me pierdo ahí, casi no... no. No entiendo ese pedazo. Ok, sería what time, como es tercera persona, sería what time does Betty start work. Y es así, coach. Perfecto. Ok. Ah, pues sería, si querés, dile tú, no sé cómo, no puedo ver quién, quién es, pero... Lo siento. Yo. Ok, tú. Ahora, Pero es que, que, tú, es que casi no, no entiendo ese pedazo. Ah, coach, ¿crees que nos ayuda aquí? Se fue el coach. Que no, ni salirme, pues. Ajá, no, no problem, it's ok. Ajá. En este tiene que hacer pregunta basado en lo amarillo. Lo amarillo va a ser la pregunta. Todo lo que tiene que hacer es interpretar qué es lo amarillo. Y, y así, de acuerdo a lo que es, se, se acuerda que allí tenemos qué, cuál, todo eso. Entonces usted tiene que interpretar y tiene que buscar cuál de esos es el correcto para formular la pregunta. Por ejemplo... Eh, el primero, every Friday. Every Friday es una constante, una repetición, es frecuencia. How often, how often. El otro es with her brother. Brother es persona. Entonces decimos who. Who does Mary practice English with? El otro es 8 a.m. Hora. Entonces, ¿cómo decimos? What time? What time? El siguiente es a lawyer. Es un job. Y se acuerda que para preguntar jobs era What does Saul do? What does Saul do? He's a lawyer. Ok. Y en el otro, a job. A job es algo. Una cosa. ¿Y qué usamos? What. Mm -hmm. what, does, eh, what does William need? A job. Tony goes to the beach. The beach es un lugar. Va a la playa los fines de semana. La playa es un lugar. Entonces, ¿qué decimos? Where. Where. Where does Tony go on weekends? Where does Tony go on weekends? To the beach. Y así va con todo lo demás. Tiene que ver qué tipo de cosa es y así usar la palabra correcta. ¿Okay? ok. Entonces la primera sería Where do you go to en este no hay que ordenarlo, pero en este hay que solo poner do or does. Ah. Para hacer ah, la pues, completa. En make information. Ah, para hacer la pregunta necesitamos. Where do you go to school? Ajá, where do you where go, do you go to, school? to school? What does Mark confront? Uh -huh. How long does it take you to shave? Yes. Sería how many children mm 
And how many children does you have? You have? Or how many children do you have? Do you have? Do, do you, you have? have? When do when you get up? When you have. Mm -hmm. you, okay. Do you get up? How often do you go out? How often out? do you go out with friends? friends. What time? What the time? Where teacher? Hola, hi. Eh, en esta parte, esta parte también la íbamos a hacer, vea. Sí. Todo lo que tienen que hacer es poner dudas. Solo va, por ejemplo, where do you go to school? Ajá, es lo que le iba a preguntar. Todo. What, what do you do? What do you do? Where do you go? Mm -hmm. Okay. Thank you, teacher. Okay, comienzo. Where do you go to school? Movie star, web. What time does? See that? Okay. What time does the movie start? Y la última sería, where, where, perdón? Where do you, la 10? Sí, where, where do you, do, correcto. Do you play soccer? Where do you play soccer? Correcto. Ok, sí. entonces resumiendo, where do you go to school? What do okay. you do? Where, where does Mark come from? How long does it take you, you to say? La cinco. How often does she study the lesson? Does she study the lesson? La seis. How many children does you have? Con do, con you, when do you get up? You, no usamos das. No. ¿Qué usamos con you? What, eh, do we use? What, what do we use with you? Do. Do. No das. Do. What when do you get up? Ah, okay, when sí. do you get up? Das uh es... -huh. Uh, he, she. He, she. Okay. It. Is she it? How often? Uh, yeah, uh, yeah, sí. mm -hmm. Entonces la respuesta sería. La pregunta, la pregunta sería: Where does James live? Y ahí, la, y ahí está la, la respuesta: James lives in San Salvador. Exacto. Uh -huh. Where? Where? Does Jane live? San Salvador es un lugar. Entonces usamos where. Where does James live? Jesse listens to music for an hour. Question. ¿Cuál es la pregunta ahí? What's the question? For an hour es por cuánto tiempo. Mm -hmm. What so, time? Uh, ¿Otra? How often? ¿Otra? Uh, <laughs> me quedé corto. <laughs> How long? How long? Ah, es cierto. How long? How long does Jesse listen to music? Okay. How long does Jesse listen to music? Mm -hmm. Okay, in number 10, on foot. Eh, on foot es una, un medio de transporte. On foot es a pie. A pie. On foot. Entonces, ¿cuál es la pregunta? ¿Cómo? 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 
How? How does Jack go to school? Go to the school. How does Jack go to school? On foot. ¿Cómo va, sí. ¿cómo va él a la escuela? A pie. A pie. Mm -hmm. How does he go to school? On foot. Mm -hmm. Ok. Lo bonito sí. de un idioma es que educa, educa la mente. Nos hace pensar un poquito y eso nos ayuda para un montón de procesos. Así sí. que no tengamos miedo. Démosle con todo, démosle con todo. Que podemos. Claro, podemos. Sí, en vez. Démosle. Ok, la, las otras es de formar, la verdad. A las otras solo sí. agregar do or das. Ok, perfecto. Por ejemplo, for example, number one, where do you go to school? Number two, what do you do? Okay. Where does Mark come from? Esa es la tercera. Qué raro, yo y dije, yo y a qué hora pasó esto, dije yo, pero bueno. <risa> no, pero no solo cuando esas oraciones están en afirmativo. Uh -huh. O sea, o en el presente, por decirlo así. Eh, no, en el ajá, en afirmativo sería. Sí. De ahí no sé si alguna tendrían alguna pregunta. O de lo que nosotros dijimos, si, si lo consideran correcto. Sí, yo estoy de acuerdo. Okay. Bueno, ahora quién nos quiere leer. <ríe> Vaya, le damos, si quieren, cinco cada uno. Va. Inicio. Where do you go to school? What do you do? Where does Mark come from? How long does it take you, take you to shape? How often does she study the lesson? Boy, okay. boy. How many children do you have? When do you get up? How often do you go out with friends? What time does the movie start? Where do you play soccer? Uh, Glenda? Okay. okay. 11. What sport do you like? El verbo. El, ¿Cómo se llama? El, o el das. What sport does el auxiliar? El auxiliar. Ante, antes del nombre, ¿verdad? Sí. 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 Ok. What sport does Tony like? Mm -hmm. Yes. Eh, lo siguiente. How mm -hmm. they. Ah, no, pero aquí lleva el verbo How también, do. ¿verdad? El auxiliar. How do. How do. How do. Solo le van a agregar el do o el das. Ok. Mm -hmm. Solo do o das. Ok. How. Do you they get to work? How do they do they, do they get to work? How do they get to work? How do they help to work? Get to work. Uh -huh. Okay. Get to work. Yes. How often do you Cuántas veces I I I been a professor Teacher, we have a problem with, uh, with two questions. Uh -huh. In 19 question, uh, we are the, uh, how much how much does this cost? Is correct? Ah, pues sí, es das. Y en la uh, for 14. 16. What does this machine do es das también verdad ah pues sí es das That's teníamos esas dos dudas teacher no problem it's okay okay gracias okay. terminamos it's finished excellent gracias nice very good okay it says how often does John goes out? 
How, how mm -hmm. often does John go out? Yeah. John go yeah. out. Si ponemos el das, ya no le ponemos la S, es el verbo. Ah, ok. The how often does John, does John go out? Ok. El, la dos sería how how does Mary practice English? Practice, no. Brother is practice. brother is una persona. Entonces usamos who. who. Who does Mary practice English? Who, perdón, sí. Who does Mary practice? Practice eh, English with. English with. 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 Sin, la, sin la S, entonces. Practice tampoco le, tampoco le ponemos la S. No, es que en las preguntas no va, ninguna va con S. Ok. Who? No, how? Who? Who? Uh, Mary practice. Who does Mary practice? English. English who, why? With. 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 What time does Betty start work? Así sería, ¿eh? What time does Betty start work? Mm -hmm. Excellent. Okay. Yes. Excelente. De ahí, Saul is lawyer. What es, does Saul do? What da, does Saul do? Saul is a lawyer, okay? Saul is a lawyer. What does he do? He's a lawyer. Mm -hmm. What does William need? What does William need? What does need William need? ¿Qué es lo que necesita William? Un trabajo. ¿no? What does William need? Mm -hmm. What does William need? Okay. Where does Tony go to the beach? No. No es. Is it, uh, how often? No. no. Ah, es oh, en, no. en los fines de semana. Es. No, lo amarillo es la respuesta. Y la, ah, lo la basamos en lo amarillo. Lo amarillo es un lugar. Es un lugar. Where, where does Tony go? On weekends. On weekends. Ah, ok. Excelente. On weekends. Mm -hmm. On weekends. Y la otra sería, why does Betty work hard? Mm -hmm. Where does James live? Where does James live? Yes. What does James lives? Yes. Live. 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 Uh -huh. Where does James live? La nueve era es How long? Por una hora. How long does Jesse listen to music? Yeah. How long does Jesse listen to music? Yes. Mm -hmm. La otra sería cómo. Eh? How How does Jack go to school? Ajá, uh -huh, exacto. Así es, ¿verdad? Excelente. Yeah, that's nice. Very good. Okay. Where do you... Okay, there are 13 people. Sixteen people. Okay. Attendance. 
Diana Verónica Pérez Rodríguez. Eric Josué Rey. Presente, presente. Okay. Present teacher. Excelente. Francisco Anderson Barrientos. Present. Eric, qué no me pusieron un papita. Too bad. <risa> <risa> pedila, pedila. Reclamar, ese <risa> reclamo formal. Ya. Yeah, <risa> Ok. Gabriela Alejandra Calderón. <risa> Present teacher. <risa> Excelente. Nice. La Gaby no se contiene. Glenda Carolina Barahona. Present teacher. Excelente. Nice. Henry Emerson Hernández. Here and sorry, coach. No, no problem. Mira las papitas, definitivamente. Ok. Irma Mercedes Flores. Ok, Jasmine de Los Ángeles Bonilla. Jasmine. Present teacher. Excellent. Hola. Nice, very good. Jelsin Karen Guzmán. Jelsin. No. Johnny Alexander Escobar. Present teacher. Excellent. Nice. Jorge Alberto Castillo. Present teacher. Ok. José Alfredo Hueso. José Alfredo Hueso. Ahí está, pero me está dormido. Present teacher. No, mentira, aquí estoy. Present teacher. Okay, excelente. Ok, María Dolores Enríquez. Presente, teacher. Excelente, nice. Marjorie Angélica Ardón. No, Marjorie didn't come today, right? Marlene Marisol Nájera. No sabemos quién es. Ok. Moisés Ernesto Meléndez. Presente. Moisés, por favor, entreme a los grupos hoy. También. Lo que pasa es que vengo manejando, teacher, vengo escuchando. Ah, viene escuchando. Ok, está bien. Porque también eso se evalúa. Los que se quedan fuera de los grupos, que están, dicen presente, pero no entran, entonces no están presentes. Sí, sí como a las nueve. 40 voy llegando a la casa, por eso siempre me conecto y veces tardecito, cabal, ya cuando ya estoy en casa. Ok. Nicole MP. Present teacher. Ok, excelente. Ramiro Rafael Aguilar. Excuse me, present teacher. Ok, nice. Rosemary Jennifer Pérez. Presente. Excelente. En Wilfredo. Ahora le conocemos la voz a Rosemary. Ok. Nice. Yes, yes very good. Um, Irma no está. Jelsey no está. Marjorie tampoco. Y Marlene Marisol no sabemos quién es, ¿verdad? Ok. Continue. Uh -huh. Let's continue. Have like that. Ok. Any questions? Ahorita no hay preguntas. Irma tiene pregunta. Ok. Question, Irma. Irma, hello. Se le activó como tic. Okay, bueno, let's continue then, my friends. We have 
Hello, Irma. Hola, buenas noches. Buenas noches. Es que me perdí la lista, disculpe, pero hasta ahorita pude llegar y se me venía cortando en el camino al Inter. <risa> ah, pero ya vino. Gracias. Sí, gracias, perdón. Va, no, no, no hay problema. Ok. okay. Eh, a veces no los, no los veo y no me contestan, entonces digo yo, ah, no vinieron hoy. Ok. No, pero hoy sí ya, ya vi que vino, lo voy a poner presente. Ok, muchas gracias. No problem. Vamos a poner aquí. Es. Ok. Entonces solo Jelsin, Marjorie, Marlene. Ok, vamos mejorando, solo son tres ahora. Eran cinco antes, ahora son tres. Ok, nice, nice, nice. Ok, ladies and gentlemen. Veamos, ¿cómo hacemos las preguntas? Las preguntas se hacen así. Ups. Este. Okay. Decimos, vamos a ir con las preguntas con who. Las preguntas con who son de sustitución y son bien fáciles. Veamos. Eh. Mary speaks French. Mary speaks French. Ok. Va. Aquí es como que dijéramos que no te... Vamos a preguntar de quién. ¿Quién habla francés? Solo sustituimos Mary, porque esa es la respuesta. Y ponemos U. Y ponemos S, ¿verdad? Sí, era Mary Speaks. Y colochito, la pregunta. Ok. Who speaks French? Who speaks French. ¿Quién habla francés? Who speaks French? Esta es sumamente fácil. La otra. Parecida a esta. Veamos. Mary and uh, John like Fish. Okay. What's the question? Who, who likes fish? Uh -huh. Who likes fish? Who likes? Who likes fish? Okay, my mom cooks at home. Question? Who cooks at home? Who cooks at home? Y me van a decir, teacher, pero todos, todos cocinan en la casa, en la calle nadie cocina. No, este, no se refiere a eso. Who cooks at home? Quiere decir, en su casa, ¿quién cocina? <laughs> A eso se refiere, no que cocinen en la calle, ¿verdad? So. Hmm. Ok. Who cooks at home? My mom. Y no lleva do, does, nada. Nada. Solo es sustitución. Sustitución simple. Ok. As Let's say yes. Jack. And Vilma. Jack and Rose. Yeah, Jack and Rose. Jack and Vilma <laughs> have exactly have uh, two children. Okay. 
Okay. Jack and Vilma have two children. Aquí los expertos, José Alfredo, Jorge, Johnny, que okay, son los expertos en children. <laughs> y también Gaby, pero la de Gaby está ya más grandecita. Bien chula. Ah, ok. Excellent. So, question, how do you make the question? Who has? ¿Cuál es la forma de, de have? Who? Uh, who has? Exactly. Who has two children? Who has two children? Vaya. Estas son las, estas se llaman subject questions. Pregunta acerca del sujeto. Este es el sujeto. Who speaks French? Who likes fish? Who cooks at home? Who has two children? Ahora vamos con el otro. El objeto. Este es el sujeto. Ahora vamos con el objeto. Veamos. Ok. Petronila loves Hermenegildo. Ok. Wow. Hermenegildo and Petronila. Ok. Beautiful name. So. Ok. Vamos a preguntar acerca de el objeto. ¿Cuál es el objeto? Hermene. Hermes. Ok. Let's change the color. Let's say that this guy is yellow. Ok, Petronila loves Hermenegildo. ¿Cuál va a ser la respuesta? Hermenegildo. Hermenegildo. Entonces Hermenegildo no puede estar en la pregunta, porque no decimos de qué color es el caballo blanco de Napoleón. No, ¿verdad? ¿Qué día de la semana, lunes, vas a venir? <risa> No, no. Ok, so no incluimos la respuesta en la pregunta. Ok, veamos. Hermenegildo es persona, entonces usamos who. Who Petronila. Y, so, perdón, en esta sí vamos a usar sujeto, vamos a usar auxiliar y todo. Mm. ¿Verdad? Who does, who does love? Does Petronila, Petronila, Petronila love. love. Judas, ajá, Judas. Judas, Petronila Love. Judas, Petronila. Judas, Petronila Love. And the answer is Hermes, Hermenegildo. Okay. Judas, Petronila Love, Hermenegildo. Ok. Let's put it for you as reference. Hermes. Okay. Hermes. <laughs> Hermes. Who does Petronila love? Hermes. Okay. Now the other one, easy one. Okay. Um, Tony plays soccer with Lucas. Okay. Lucas is the answer. Lucas is the answer. So, what do we say? Who does Tony play soccer? Who does Tony? Play soccer with. Play soccer with. 
Who does Tony play soccer with? Who does Tony play soccer with? Ok, excellent. Ahora combinemos. Ok. Uh -huh. Marcel hates Betty. Ok. <laughs> Ugly Betty. <laughs> Ugly Betty, uh -huh. exacto. Formarse, Betty is ugly. Formarse, no, formarse, no. Marse is beautiful. Marse, <laughs> no formarse, but for Marse. Uh -huh. Ok. Let's see. Marse is A. Betty is B. Ok, veamos la pregunta A. Question A. Question A, la respuesta va a ser Marce. Entonces la pregunta es ¿cómo? Who Betty hate? Mm -mm. Who does? Mm -mm. Ya se les olvidó. Simple substitution. Solo sustitución. Ajá. Who hates Betty? Mm -hmm. Exactly. Who hates Betty? Uh, Marcela. Who hates Betty? Who hates Betty? Marcela. Marce das. Ok, B, question B. Ahora sí, auxiliar. Who does hate Marce? Who does Marce hate? Hate. Who does Marce hate? ¿A quién odia Marce? Odia Marce. <risa> <risa> o sea, no puede amarse. Ajá. ¿A quién odia Marce? Imagine a Marcy. No. Ajá. Betty. La respuesta aquí sería Betty. Ok. Ahora vamos con otro. Parecido. Eh, Miguel talks to Nah, talks with. Recipro. Talks with Maria. Miguel talks with Maria. Miguel talks with Maria. Miguel is A. Miguel is A. What's the question? Who talk? Who? Who talks with Maria? Exactly. Who talks with Maria? Maria. Who talks with Maria? Miguel. Miguel does. Miguel does. Okay. B. Now, Siri. Who does? Who does? Who does? Who does? Uh -huh. Miguel, Miguel, Miguel talk. 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 Who does Miguel talk? With. with. Who does Miguel talk with? Maria. Who does Miguel talk with? Maria. Okay. Another example. Another example. Marcelino visits Marcelino visits Florentino 
Ben. Marcelino is A, Florentino is B. Question A. Who visits Florentino? Who visits Florentino? Mm -hmm. Who visits Florentino? B. Who does Marcelino visit? Marcelino visit. Who does Marcelino visit? Marcelino visit. Who does Marcelino visit? Okay. Another example. Let's see. Pedro works for Pablo. Pablo. Pedro works for Pablo. Excellent. So, Pedro is A, Pablo is B. Okay, question. Who works? Work. Who works for Pablo? Who works? Who works for Pablo? Who works for Pablo? Pedro David. Who does? Who does? Who does? Who does Pedro? Pedro work for for. Who does Pedro work for? Who does Pedro work for? Who does Pedro work work for? For. Who does Pedro work for? Who does Pedro work for? Yes, Gaby. Tengo una pregunta. Este, cuando se hace pregunta, ¿el verbo cambia o no cambia? Es que estaba viendo que en, quiero ver, en la, de este, la, la del primer lado que dice, who speaks French, ahí sí cambia, pero abajo donde está Petronila, puso Judas Petronila, love, no cambió. O sea, no se le agrega el S. No. En, en el que who speaks French es porque es sustitución. Si se fija, uh -huh. todo lo que son a, el verbo no cambia, solo sustituye usted, a menos que el, el, la, la respuesta sea plural. Si la respuesta es plural, entonces sí va a ser, el, le va a poner ese al verbo, porque siempre con who, los ver, las preguntas son singulares. Who, who works, who study. Uh, yeah, creo que más o menos. Yeah. Who speaks French? Who likes fish? Who cooks at home? Who has two children? Okay. Thank you. Welcome. Okay. Teacher. teacher. Pero, 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 en el de Miguel Talks with María, los dos cambiaron. Veamos. Ay, no, 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 olvídelo, olvídelo. No, 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 me confundí, perdón, perdón. Ajá. Ya vi, ya, ya vi. Ya. Ok. Thank you, teacher. No problem. Ya estamos cansados, no explica. Teacher, una consulta. ¿Por qué siempre eh, la B-Question lleva el auxiliar y en la primera no? Porque es el, en la primera usted pregunta acerca del sujeto. Entonces, el, el, digamos, el pronombre interrogativo sustituye al sujeto. Teacher no le entiende. Vale, vamos, no, le vamos a poder, no le vamos a decir nombres eh, rimbombantes, ¿verdad? Solo le vamos a decir. Vale. En el caso este, la letra A es Marce, ¿verdad? Y Marce usted lo sustituye por Who. 
solo es sustitución, entonces no hay problema. Who hates Betty? O Miguel talks, to, talks with María. Who talks with María? Entonces, en ese caso, solo es simple sustitución. No le pone, o sea, no hay ningún cambio. O sea, solamente si fuera plural, usted le agregaría la S en el caso del verbo. Porque la respuesta sería plural, pero como usted no la sabe, todas las preguntas son en singular. Porque usted no sabe la respuesta. Porque si la siquiera, ¿para qué pregunta? Thank como, you, teacher. como dice Cantinflas. Bueno, maestro, si sabe la respuesta, ¿para qué pregunta? Le dice, ¿quién descubrió América? Ah, yo no sé, mi papá no fue, le dice. Fue Cristóbal Colón. Bueno, si usted sabe la respuesta, ¿para qué pregunta? <ríe> en este caso aquí no es así. Aquí vamos a decir, bueno, no sabemos la, 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 la respuesta. La respuesta puede ser singular o plural, pero la pregunta siempre será singular. Por eso se fija en la pregunta. Who speaks French? Cualquiera podría decir yo, 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 yo. Y serían varias personas. Sería plural. They speak French. Y lo mismo. Who likes fish? Varios podrían responder yo, 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 yo. Porque ese es ¿a quién le gusta el pescado? Who likes fish? I do, I do, I do, I do, I do, I do, I do. Okay. Y vaya, y en la otra resplada la pregunta, ¿por qué lleva auxiliar la, la B? Lleva auxiliar porque tiene sujeto. Siempre que lleve un sujeto va a ponerle auxiliar. Si el, si el sujeto es plural, va a usar do. Si el sujeto es singular, va a usar das. Bueno. Esa sería la respuesta. Ahora veamos otros ejemplos. Y ya vamos a pasar a los ejercicios porque ya es casi la hora. Ya, ya tomamos un break. My world. But you eat pupusas. Do you eat pupusas? Where do you eat pupusas? How often do you eat pupusas? Who do you eat pupusas with? ¿Con quién come pupusas? Dice, con mi mamá, con mi papá, con mi hermano. Ok. Who do you eat pupusas with? Ok. Veamos. What time do you get up? What kind of music do you like? How often do you go out? How far do you live from here? How long do you wait for the doctor? How much do you pay for your internet service? How many friends do you have? Ok. Para otras preguntas, solo tengo dos minutos. Ok, hagamos la otra, la otra. Vamos a hacer aquí en este espacio. Veamos. Silvia loves cats. Ok. Silvia loves cats. Vamos a hacer la pregunta acerca de cats. ¿Cómo hacemos la pregunta? Cats are animals. So we use what? What does Silvia love? What does Silvia love? Cats. Okay. Veamos. Jack reads magazines. Bueno, ni las lee, solo las ojea. Ok. Ok. This is the answer. Magazines. What's the question? What, what does Jack read? read? What does Jack read? Exactly. What does Jack read? Ok. 
Okay, another one. Let's see. Betty lives in Tampa, Florida. Betty lives in Tampa, Florida. The answer is going to be Tampa, Florida. Okay. Where's there Betty live? Another one. Where does where Betty live? Does Betty live. Betty live. live. Betty live. Where does Betty live? Where does Betty live? Where does Betty live? In Tampa, Florida. Live in Tampa. In Tampa, Florida. Florida. She lives in Tampa, Florida. Mm -hmm. Okay, okay, okay. Another one. Um, Tony plays soccer at um, El. ¿Cómo se llamaba la cancha de Santa Tecla? Café Talón. Las Delicias. El Café Talón. Ajá, sí, la, de, la cancha de las Delicias también, ¿verdad? Podemos el Café Talón. Yo dije no se van a acordar. Ok. Excelente. Nice. Me llega que se acuerden. Ok, question. Where does Tony play soccer? Select. Where does Tony where does Tony start play soccer? Where does Tony play soccer? At, At el cafetalón. Exacto. Mm -hmm. La pregunta la hacemos de acuerdo a la respuesta que buscamos. Si queremos saber acerca de un lugar, preguntamos where. Si queremos saber acerca de la hora, preguntamos when o what. Time. Time. Preferiblemente what time, porque es más específico. What time. Uh -huh. Si queremos saber de quién, who. ¿Verdad? Ok, sería la respuesta. Ok. Uh, me pasé los dos minutos que tenía. Le, let's go. Let's continue, my friends. Pero la idea es que les quede claro. Eso es, eso es lo más importante. Mm -hmm. Que les quede claro. Vamos a la práctica. Task, practice, purpose. To ask partners about different information. Where is that volcano? Where is that volcano? Mona Loa, es volcano Mona Loa en eh, Hawaii. Ok. Y Chair, esto ya lo practicamos, sí, pero este, este de abajo. Ok. Lo vamos a hacer de nuevo. Y lo vamos a hacer juntos. Veamos el primero. Para que vean la gran, la amplitud que tiene. Ok. Number one. Help me. Where, where do you live? Where? Where do you live? Where do you live? ¿Alguna otra forma? Any other way? No other way, right? Where do you live? How do you live? ¿Cómo vives? How do you live? How do you live? Why do you live now? ¿Por qué vives? No. Why? No reason. Ah, ah, por mi hijo. Ah, ok. No para mí. Who far? No. ¿Hm? How far do you live? How far do you live? ¿Qué tan lejos vives? Exactly. Excellent. Perfect. How far do you live? 
How far do you live? Okay, number two, does your sister do for a living? What? What? What does your sister do for a living? Number three. What? What? Exactly to you. What exactly do, do you do at work? Solamente. What exactly do you do at work? Four. Mm -hmm. oh. Monday. When? What when? time? Yeah. When do you usually get to work? When? Oh. Yeah. Possible. Yes. Vamos a what? How? Pero when es también es possible. When? when? What time? What time do you usually get to work? Mm -hmm. okay. Five. What time when do you get up? What time? Lo mejor es what time, pero podemos usar when. When también. When do you get up? Excess, uh, number six. What time? What time? Pero también podemos decir when. When does your English class start? Seven. Why? Why do you need permission to go home? Uh, how? Sorry? How? How do you need permission to go home? Uh, um, Como tú necesitas, pero no. ¿Cómo? No, no. ¿Quién sería? Who? ¿Quién? How? ¿Quién? Who? ¿De quién? Si ponemos quién, tenemos que ponerle from. Who do you need permission to go home from? Y sounds raro. Pero okay. que, yo, puede, puede ser otro. Veamos. Si no, why no. Tenemos. Why do you need permission to go home? Who? ¿Quién necesita permiso para ir a casa? No, porque allí sería you. Tendría ah, who do you? Uh -huh. Who needs permission? Who permission. needs permission to go home? You, entonces no. Cambia toda la pregunta. Sí, tendría que ser solo why. Veamos. Hey. Where? Where? Ajá. Posibilidades? Possibilities? How far? When? Uh -huh. When? Correcto. How far? How far does your system work? How well? ¿Qué también trabaja tu hermana? How well? How often? How often? <laughs> hey, 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 toco madera. Pom, pom. <laughs> Al mismo tiempo, digamos. How often? <laughs> Uh -huh. no trabaja mucho, pero... <laughs> how, how often does your sister work? How long? How long? Yes, exactly. How long? No un gran how long. No un gran how long. Okay. How Chen long? Cheng long. Sí. How long? Vamos a poner por aquí. Si la pregunta es how often... Does your system work? La respuesta es on all, all night long. Every day? Ah, all, all, night, all night long. Okay, sí, podría ser que trabajar el sí. día. O si no, all day long, todo el día. All day long. All day long. 12, mm -hmm. 12 hours per day. Sí, 12, 12 hours a day. Mm -hmm. A day. 12 hours a day. Okay, nine. When? Where? When do you play soccer? Okay, si decimos where. Where? Decir. Where y when? When? When do you play soccer? How often? Why? 
Aha. Why? What, what time? What time? How often? How often? How well? How well? How far? Mm -hmm. How far? How far? Oh. How far? Okay. How far? How well? What time? Why? When? How well? How far? How often? Okay. Yeah. Ten. Igual. Where? Why? Why do you go to work? <laughs> when? <laughs> okay. Why? When do you go to work? How do you go to work? ¿Cómo te vas al trabajo? Okay. Oh. Veamos. When, when do you go to work? When. Why? Why is the best? Why? What time? ¿Por qué, por, qué, oh. ¿Por qué vas al trabajo? <laughs> Porque tengo que hacer. <laughs> Porque tengo hambre. Because I need money. Porque si no, no como. I need money. I because I need to earn money. A lot of money. Earn money. I need to earn money. So, how? Okay, when, why, what time? What time do you go to work? Okay. 11. What? What do you do your job? Um, I have, llevamos la respuesta. Otro. How? ¿Cómo How? Trabajo? How do you do your work, your job? ¿Cómo haces tu trabajo? How? Posibilidades. How? Why? How well? How well? How well do you do your job? Sí. Why How do often? you do your job? See, sí. why do you do your job también? How often do you do your job? See. Sí. How far? Or... How far? Sí, un poco más rebuscado, pero podría ser. How far? How far? Okay. Do you study? What? What do you study? <laughs> Options. When? Why? When? Where? When? Where? Where? Why? How far? Yeah. How often? Yes. How well? Uh, how often? How long? Yeah. How long? <laughs> How long, Cheng Long? Okay. How long? How long do you study? When do you study? Where do you study? Why do you study? How often do you study? How long do you study? Excellent. How kid? No. Kid? No. How kid? What time? No. In that case, only how long, how, how well? How well do you study? Mal, <laughs> mal. Okay. 13. What time? Okay, yeah. What time? Sí, porque how often no. Okay. Mm. <laughs> what time, how often does your brother have, have lunch? Every, how often? <laughs> every day. <laughs> Hopefully. Okay. Where? How long? How long does your brother have lunch? Mm, well, sí. Eh, suena raro, pero está bien. How, when? How long? Se when? When does your brother see? Mm -hmm. Where? Yeah, yes, sir. Sí. Why does your brother have lunch? Because he's hungry. Okay, enough. 14. What time? What time do you study English? Why? 
Yeah, why? Why? Where? 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 How long? How well? Mm -hmm. How long? Where? When? How often? Exactly. Etc. 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 Okay. Fifteen. What time? Okay, what time? What time? What time do you go out? When? 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 Why? What? How often? How often do you go out? Why do you go out? When do you go out? Okay, enough. Where do you go out now? Do you go out with? Who? Who do you go out with? Who? 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 La preposición solamente ese puede ser. Sí. Okay. But you see many possibilities. Many possibilities. Okay. How do we complete this one? Where? Does your boss? Where does your boss come from? How do you? How do you work? get to work? How do you get to work? Why do you Why work, do you work, work so hard? hard? Why do you work so hard? How long do you, do you study? study the lesson? And um, do you study listen the listen? Okay, who who do, do you, you work? With? Who do you go to work with? Work with. Wait. You go to work with. Wait. When does this class? When does this class finish? This class finish. What do you want to? What do, do you want to do tonight? What do you want to do tonight? What time do, do you get up? get up? Do you get up? How often do, do you visit you visit relatives? How often do you visit relatives? Which book? Do you need? Which book do you need? This or that one. Who does your sister? Who does go? your sister? Who does your sister go yeah. out? Who does your sister go out? Where do you where study? Do you study the lesson? Where do you study the lesson? Why? The lesson? Uh -huh. do you Why do you eat so do much? You eat so much? Why do you eat so much? Which job do you, do you prefer? Do you prefer? Do you prefer? Do you prefer? Why? Why do you get? Do you get up so early? Do you get up so early? When? When do, do you see your girlfriend? When do you see your girlfriend? Okay, excellent. That's it. Easy. Okay, put mm -hmm. in order. Put in order. Where do you live? Where do you live? Mm -hmm. Where? How often do you go dancing? How often do you go dancing? How often do you go? Where does, where does your sister work? Where does, your Where does your sister work? Where does your sister work? How does your sister go to sister work? Go to work? Okay. How does your sister How does your sister go to work? Who, who teach who teach English you? Who teaches you English? You English. Who teaches you English? English. You can say English. Who teaches you English? 
What, what time does, what time does your English class start? What time does your English class start? What time does your English class, sorry, your, what time does your class start? Who cleans your house? Who cleans your house? cleans your house who who cooks dinner, who cooks dinner at home who cooks dinner at home what, what? does your brother Where does your soccer. brother? Soccer. soccer, play soccer. Where does your brother play soccer? No. Soccer. Uh -huh. <laughs> soccer. Okay. So the other one. What time do you? What time do you finish work? What time do you finish work? What, what time, time do, you do? do you go to bed? Do you go to bed? What time do you go to bed? What do you what do, do in the do office? Do what do you do in the office? When, when does open the bank? The bank the open. Bank. When does the bank open? When does the bank open? Open. How do you say leche in English? How do you say leche in English? Leche. Milk. How do you say let's change English? Okay, sorry, this is capital. How long? How long do you study do you study the lesson? How long do you study the lesson? Why, Why do you need permission? Why do you need permission? Why do you need permission? Okay, easy. Piece of cake. Okay. Other questions? Why does she like him? Por qué le gusta a él a ella? Why does she like him? Está bonita, creo. No. ¿Por qué le gusta a él? Gusta a él? Porque está bonita. Pero ¿Por qué le gusta a él a ella? Why does she like him? Do they are Asian people? Asian? Asian. Uh -huh. Yeah, no me importa. She doesn't have any money. She doesn't have any money. She Say like this. 
Okay. Let me see, we're going to make something easy. Okay, this is a dialogue. A feo, eh? mm -hmm. Yeah, it's an ugly dialogue. It says, Hello. Hi. Hello. What do you need? I don't need anything. Why do you ask? People talk to me when they need something. Why do you have to be different? I only want to say hello. Okay, hello, bye-bye. You don't need to be so rude. Okay, have a nice day, bye. So, some people are very rude, okay? All right, I am A, you are B. Hello. Hi, what do you need? What do you need? I don't need anything. Why do you ask? People talk to me when you need something. Why do you have to be different? I only want to say hello. Okay, hello, bye-bye. You don't need to be <laughs> Okay, have a nice day, bye. Okay, change. You are A and B. Hello. Hi, what do you need? I don't need anything. What do you ask? People talk to me when they need something. Why do you have to be different? I only want to say hello. Okay, hello, bye-bye. <laughs> you don't need to be so rude. Okay, have a nice day. Bye. Okay, excellent. Very good. Let's see. Volunteers. Uh, Jose Alfredo is A. Johnny is B. Okay. Yes. Hello. Hi, what do you need? I don't need an anything. Na anything. 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 Mm -hmm. Wait. Why do you like, why do you ask? Ask. Ask. Why do you ask? People talk to me when they need something. Why do you have to be different? I only want to say hello. Okay, hello. Bye bye. You, you don't need to be surreal. Okay. 
to rule. Okay. Have a nice day. Bye. Okay. Thank you very much. Now. Thank you, teacher. Yes, you're welcome. Letter A is Wilfredo. Letter B is Gabby. Hello. Hi, what do you need? I don't need anything. Why do you ask? People talk to me when they need something. Why do you have to be different? I only want to say hello. Okay, hello, bye-bye. I don't need to be so rude. Okay, have a nice day. Have a nice day, bye. Okay, excellent, very good. Thank you very much. Henry is A. Let me see who else is around. Okay, Eric. Eric is A. And um, Henry is B. Okay. Hello. Hi, what do you need? I don't need anything. Why do you ask? People talk to me when they need something. Why do you have to be different? I only want to say hello. Okay, hello, bye bye. You don't need to be so rude. Okay, have a nice day, bye. Okay, excellent. Uh, Glenda is A, Ramiro is B. Okay, hello. Hi, what do you need? I don't need anything. What do you ask? People talk to me when they need something. Why do you have to be different? I only want to say hello. Okay, hello, bye bye. You don't need to be so Good. wrong. Good. 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 Okay, have a nice day. Bye bye. Have a nice day. Bye bye. Have a nice, have a nice day. Bye. Okay, excellent. Thank you very much. Thank you. Okay. Attendance. Welcome. Attendance. Let's see. Diana Veronica Perez. Presente. Excellent. Eric Josue Reyes. Present teacher. Excellent. Nice. Francisco Anderson Valle. Mm -hmm. Gabriela Alejandra Calderón. Present teacher. Excellent. Glenda Carolina Barahona. Present teacher. Excellent. Nice. Henry Emerson Hernandez. Here, coach. Excellent. Irma Mercedes Flores. Present teacher. Excellent. Nice. Jasmine de Los Angeles Bonilla. Present teacher. Excellent. Nice. Jelsin Karen Guzmán. Johnny Alexander Escobar. Present teacher. Excellent. Nice. Jorge Alberto Castillo. Present teacher. Excellent. Very good. Jose Alfredo Hueso. Present teacher. Nice, very good. Okay, Maria Dolores Enriquez. Present teacher. Excellent, nice. Marjorie. Marlene. Okay, Moises Ernesto Meléndez. Presente. Excellent, nice. Nicole MP. Ramiro Rafael Aguilar. Present teacher. Excellent, nice. Rosemary Jennifer Perez. Wilfredo Jose Morris. Present teacher. Excellent, nice, very good. Okay, ladies and gentlemen, let me see. Teacher no me mencionó. Dije Nicole MP, pero creo que no me vio. Okay. Don't worry, Nicole. You are present. Okay. Hoy se quedaba conmigo. 
Veamos. Se me olvidó revisar. Hoy es clase 12. José Alfredo Hueso. José Alfredo Hueso. Oh, very good. Very nice. Excellent. Okay. Ladies and gentlemen, thank you very much for attending tonight. We stop here. I will see you tomorrow. Okay. Bye bye. See you tomorrow. Good, good morning, night. Teacher. Good all. night. Good night. Good night. And bye bye. Buenas noches, teacher. Buenas noches. Bye -bye. Bye -bye. Okay. You too. Sleep well. Bye bye. Bye bye. I see you tomorrow. Teacher. Yes. Eh, Podría poner la página 18 solo para tomar una, una foto, por favor. No problem, claro, of course. Eh, perdón, profe. No, la, que, la, que, la que puso usted que varias opciones. Ah, ok. Ok, thank you, teacher. You're welcome, no problem. Ok. José Alfredo, how are you doing? ¿Cómo puedo ayudarle, José Alfredo? Ok. ¿En qué tiene duda? ¿En ¿Cómo le puedo ayudar? Bien, teacher, que ahorita me acaba de surgir una duda referente al do y el das. Ajá. Porque anterior, anteriormente, según mis apuntes, vea. Eh, ocupábamos el das. Eh, para si she, no me equivoco para y she it y she it ajá cabal pero ahora cuando decimos que lo ocupamos para el sujeto o el objeto eh, ah no pero ahí ya no es ahí me, me siento ahí ya no es das allí lo que usamos para sujeto y para Objeto es U. U. No, pero usamos el auxiliar, ¿no? Eh, solamente usamos el auxiliar cuando tenemos un sujeto. Y el auxiliar puede ser tú o puede Ajá, ser. Vaya. Ajá, entonces era, esa era mi duda. Esa es mi duda, más bien. Ahí me sentí un poco enredado porque Va, si lo ocupamos para el. Y si, entonces, Pero, cuando entramos al sujeto. Me refiero a este, va. Póngale. Ajá. Aquí estamos hablando de who, que, por ejemplo, Marce hates Betty. Marce es el sujeto, Betty es el objeto, ¿verdad? Entonces, estamos usando aquí uh -huh. este Marce para, Marce para sujeto y Betty para objeto. Entonces, cuando hacemos la pregunta de sujeto, solo sustituimos. Vale. Tapamos Marce y ponemos who. Who hates Beth. Entonces, ya no necesitamos. Ahí no usamos auxiliar. Usamos who. Ahora, si vamos a preguntar acerca de Betty, sí. Porque como el sujeto es Marce, entonces necesitamos un auxiliar. Who does Marce hate? Siempre que vayamos a preguntar acerca del objeto, vamos a necesitar un auxiliar y vamos a usar das si el sujeto es he, she, or it. Pero si el sujeto es plural, 
va por decir algo, pongamos, pongamos aquí. Digamos que decimos. They love Mary. Vamos a preguntar acerca de Mary. Y como vamos a preguntar acerca de Mary. Ya tenemos sujeto, ¿verdad? ¿Cuál es el sujeto? Uh -huh. they. Mary. No, May, Mary es el objeto. Ah, perdón. They. Tenemos they. Sí, Mary es el, el objeto. They es plural, ¿verdad? ¿Qué usamos con they? Uh -huh. Do. Entonces decimos. Who do. Who do they love? Who do they, do they. love? Who do they love? Who do they love? ¿Por qué usamos do? Porque es they. ¿Por qué usamos auxiliar? Porque tenemos ellos. Porque tenemos sujeto. Ellos son animales. Ajá. Ah. Ah, ok. O sea, siempre que utilicemos el sujeto. Independ eh, eh, ahí nosotros vemos en cómo aplicamos el do, el das. Correcto. En este caso, no. Sí. Sí, tiene que ver cuál es el sujeto para poner do o das. Si el sujeto es tercera persona, singular, usa das. Si es tercera persona, plural, usa do. Como they es tercera persona, pero es plural, entonces usa do. Digamos que si ah, en okay. fuera we, who do we love? Si fuera you, who do you love? ¿Verdad? Who do you love? Who do they love? Uh -huh. Love. Ese sería. No sé si ese le, con, le contesta la, la, pregunta, la duda que tenía. Sí, teacher, la verdad que sí, porque estaba algo trabado en, en ocupar, cómo ocupar el do y el das. Estaba combinándolo con, la, con las clases anteriores y no, no, no. Y no le daba. No cuadraba muy bien, pero con este ejemplo que me acaba de mostrar. Ajá. Sí. Me preguntaba por qué. Ajá. Porque si se fija. Pero en creo nosotros, que con esto sí ya. Y nosotros, porque todos los sujetos eran singulares. Marce, ella. Miguel, él. Marcelino, él. Pedro, él. Entonces, todos eran singulares. Entonces, por eso es que usábamos das. Das Pedro. Uh -huh. Das Marce. Das Marcelino. Das Miguel. ¿Verdad? Ese es el azul. Pero en este caso, they love Mary. Who do they love? Uh -huh. Tiene que ser. El, que es plural. Que es plural. Así es. ¿Alguna otra duda? Entonces, digamos, para el plural. Sí, para el plural. Du. Du. Uh -huh. Y para otros sujetos. Por ejemplo, singular. Como hay y you, que son singulares, pero usamos do. No, no así con la tercera persona, ¿verdad? Es he, she, and it. Con ellos sí usamos das. Ok. Ok. ¿Alguna otra okay. duda? Creo que referente hasta esta, hasta esta clase, creo que solamente esa era mi, mi duda, teacher. Ok. Porque creo que usted bien claro a la hora de explicar. Ok, thank you. Entonces, lo dejo para que vaya a hacer la tarea y se duerma temprano. Ok. Thank you for attending the class. Temprano. Tipo 12. Tipo 12, cabrón. Por ahí no puedo estar, ya tengo que subir la clase. Ok, teacher. Ok, take care, my friend. See you ok, teacher. Muchas gracias. Un placer. See you take tomorrow, care. teacher. Tomorrow, be good. Take care. Thank you, teacher. You're welcome.